All right, folks, we're here with uh, anglerschannel.com pro staffer Robbie Dye. Just finished up fishing the BFL here on Lake Wiley this Saturday, June the 15th. And Robbie, 94 boats came out today. Uh, the lake level's very full. Uh, you had about 11 pounds. Leading the tournament right now, 16-8. Mm -hmm. Do you see anybody beating that? I don't think so, John. That's a pretty good weight. Uh, you know, the fish uh, were on some brim beds today, and uh, you know, a lot of boat traffic out there. If you didn't get them for lunchtime, uh, it was extremely tough. Uh, you know, saying you know the fish were on some brim beds. There also, was a lot of fish deep. A lot of guys caught some deep, but I primarily fish shallow. And caught quite a few fish, just no good fish, John. Now, somebody else is mentioning fish being on the brim beds. Does that happen when the water level gets this high? Well, it actually. You know, water's up so high you can't see the brim so you got to know where they're at and uh, the water level scattered the fish somewhat so 16.8 that's a good weight well 11 pounds was solid you know one thing I see today everybody's weighing in fish so people caught a lot of fish today they did you know this lake's full of fish but you know the bass virus has passed through here and uh, a lot of skinny fish a lot of skinny fish yeah the boat traffic really hurt it yeah you're not seeing a lot of five six seven pound uh, no, kickers in no. there but it's still a great lake to fish, and, uh, you know, caught a lot of fish, just not no big ones. All right, buddy. Well, good seeing you. Okay, bud. Okay, folks, now we got Michael Murphy from Lexington, South Carolina. Just came off Lake Wiley today at the BFL, and, Michael, we just talked to Robbie Dye. He had 11 pounds. You had about 11 pounds. Uh, you know, Wiley's fishing well, just tough to find that quality. Well, I'll tell you what, they, they have a great year class out there, no joke. I, my goal was to catch 70 fish today, fell a little short, had 55. That's how good it's fishing. If you just want to catch fish, you need to bring the kids, you need to come out and just go fishing. 55 fish. 55 fish today. And, you know, the water had been up. They've been flipping up the river. You just go on up to Catawba. Um, they've been deep. It's like there's nothing in between. They're either in the dirt up the Catawba and up uh, the south, uh, whatever that fork is up there, uh, or they're way deep, 25, 30 foot, and catching them uh, long line and crankbaits. A lot of guys, you know, caught onto that this week. But there was so much fishing pressure. Those fish were still there. You just had to slow down and drop shot them. It was like playing a video game. You could see them on your graph, just drop that drop shot down and it was catching them. I was catching them on a, the, the Opti Series uh, Victory Shad and just a real natural, uh, 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 the sexy shad color, anything shad color, drop them down there and it, they would get it right away. It's like playing a video game. So they're out there, just look 25, 30 foot. If it's a point, looks good, they're there and uh, just come out and check it out. It 55 good. fish. 55 fish. Well, that's awesome, man. Hey, good seeing you. And 16 eights leading. Do you see anybody beating that today? You know, that's, that's a pretty tough weight on this lake. You know, there's a lot of fish. Um, it's just hard to come by them three pounders. Yeah. So I think that's going to hold up. It's going to be right about that. That's why I guess. All right, buddy. Good seeing you. Thank you.